amazing Steve <laughs> Mitchell, the one of a kind bicycling madman that goes nowhere, and goes 20 miles an hour, but goes nowhere. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? He's fixing 20 it. miles an hour going, going nowhere. nowhere. <laughs> Why does this man do this? To support the East Coast Greenway. What is East Coast Greenway? It's a multi-use trail, bike trail, if you will, from Key West, Florida to Canada. And along the road or off the road? It's mainly off the road, and it will be being built right now uh, from Key West to Canada. And uh, our goal is to have an all off-road bike trail. Cars are good things. Bicycles are good things. But sometimes on the same pavement, not so good. So this would be a safe trail. Safe trail. The safety is the key to keep the bicycles off the road and to have families, people riding with their kids, people commuting. It's going to connect 13 cities and Washington, D.C., 13 states in Washington, D.C. Including Jacksonville, Florida? Jacksonville, Florida. Great section right through here now. There's actually a very good example here in Jacksonville called the Jacksonville Baldwin Rail Trail. It's 14 miles long. And uh, it's uh, a very good example of what the East Coast Greenway is going to be. Is this where America is headed? Uh, we are... Definitely headed in the direction of using alternatives to cars. Like I said, cars are good things, but uh, we need alternatives. The transportation initiatives in this country for many, many years have been too automotive and truck centric, too focused on faster and faster on cars, not necessarily environmentally friendly. And for short distances, this would make sense. People could commute. Wonderful commute. It would also help major cities. Like I know Jacksonville has a major traffic problem in the morning. So if more people commuted on their bike, it would ease traffic and would ease the uh, environmental and pollution concerns around the city of Jacksonville. And we could do this if we had paved off-road trails. It That's would be safe. That's exactly correct. You're amazing. Amazing. And we could also, because we already have facilities for bicycles on buses, you could ride some portions with your bike on a bus and other portions just on the trail. That's exactly right, Herb. And for everyone that can hear me, I know why you're watching me. You're waiting for me to fall off. No. Mm -hmm. But if you could take the information on the, the left of me, off the desk, it's uh, brochures on the East Coast Greenway. Go to www.greenway.org. Would you say that again? www.greenway.org for all the information that you could possibly want on the East Coast Greenway. Well, thank you very much, Steve. Oh, I'm having fun. Can Carry on. I'm, I'm on the road to, to nowhere like to be on the road to the East Coast Greenway, which I'm going to try this afternoon. And uh, what a great project. I want to thank Herb Hiller and Steve Davis for having me down here in Jacksonville. Hope to come to a city near you with our uh, East Coast Greenway display. And uh, look forward to all you out there helping get this done. Whoa, 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 whoa.